Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome to another MAMJ Let's Play of Nightmare of the Snow. When we left off, uh, Yuki fought her evil self with a samurai sword, and it was pretty amazing. Now, I don't know what I'm doing. Um, I guess I'm Kayoko, and we fell down. Down, down into the depths of badness. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna look around and see what I can find. It looks like that they cook here. Okay, who's they? Many expired food and seasonings on the shelf. So hopefully nobody's down here with us. Although I don't like how quiet it is down here. Ooh, a mirror. Okay, sure. Save. And anything else here? This is all the same. Alright then. Some kind of like trap door. Ooh, notes. Okay. There's a note on the floor. Shinokage Ray's Paranormal Investigation Part 9. He wrote a lot of things. The Kiriata family has the tendency to fish. It is how they survive during the dry season where crops won't grow very much. The family member usually carries a fishing rod wherever they're out for hunting during a war. Seiji no Kiriata discovered that there is a lake beneath the mansion's demon path when he was digging underground alongside with the other family members. After doing some research, she also discovered that the lake is connected to the sea. Well, lucky him! The lake is inhabited by both freshwater, water, and saltwater fishes. But of course, in this lost dimension, there won't be any fish, nor even a single plankton in the lake. I've been fishing for about two hours and found nothing. After the discovery of the underground lake, many Kirihara family members started to choose the path of fisherman instead of warrior and lives inside the rooms built for fishermen. Oh, and lives inside. Got it, not lives, but still, can I get a fishing rod? That'd be awesome. Probably not though. All right, what's in here? Some notes. Uh, okay. Trap concept, the boulder. The rest of the paper is covered in dried blood. It's unreadable. The boulder? Oh, yay. Which one of these is gonna kill me? Uh, the fish breeding pond. I don't see anything here. Did I pick the right path or is the boulder something else? Uh, I don't feel safe. Huh. No. No Indiana Jones style. Whoa! <laughs> yep. Okay. There's the boulder. Well, how in the world am I supposed to avoid that thing? She's not that fast. Okay. Well. Guess I don't have to worry about those then. How am I going to get away from that? Hello? Ooh, I made it! Oh, I made it! Whoa, whoa, whoa! I almost died! Was that a trap? Yes, it was, and you actually did die once. But it's okay, we're all right now. Is there another one? I feel like there's going to be more. Like, that wasn't the only one. It's meant to keep you feeling safe. But I never feel safe. The door is locked. Really? It's locked? How am I going to get out? Oh, there's a door here. I didn't know that. Below this place is the abyss of darkness. Those who fall into the abyss will experience an endless fall into the infinity darkness. So, don't fall in there. That's what you're telling me. Lots of books on the shelf. Okay, the Dragon Path. The Dragon Path is the only path that Seijido forbids everyone to pass. It is where the sacred tools for removing the curse of the ice reincarnation ritual were hidden. The sacred tools are consisted of... Koritsugi, uh, Koritsuguri, the Holy Mallet, and Ice God Stake. The instruction for removal of the curse was sealed away by Seijiro. He didn't want anyone to discover the curse removal technique, nor allow anyone to do it. The reason is unknown. I guess the Seijiro guy was hiding something. Or maybe he's plotting something back then. The next time I meet Shirokage, I'll have to ask him about Seijiro. True. 
Anything over here? Oh, there's another note. Alright, the connecting places among the four paths. The four paths of the mansion is not just connected by four paths center. They're actually connected by several other ways. For example, the underground lake connects to the other side of the ice cavern. The Kiriata family's arsenal storage also connects to the cave underneath the Shinigami path. Okay. That's good to know, right? I guess we're going to go through this door now. Oh, this sounds lovely. Actually, it looks pretty cool. Hello? Uh, I don't feel safe right now. To be completely honest with you. There's a couple areas of that fence missing, but I'm not dumb enough to just jump on into that. Oh, it's dark. We've got a couple areas here we can go in. Okay, we got the healing thing. We got a We got a mirror, so we need to save. All right. So, what's in here? It's a coin. Oh, okay. Cool. Yeah, let's get some drinks. Coffee for everyone. Although I really don't use it that much. You know, I don't think I've ever used a can of coffee, and I got a bunch of them. How many cans of coffee do I have? 8. <laughs> okay. And a first aid kit. I got lots of things. I know there's a stairway down there, but I want to see what's over here first. Oh. Oh my god. Don't walk into it, dummy. This is... The dragon path. That voice. Taiga. Oh. Yay. Whoa, Kyoko. Christ, I finally found you. I'm surprised that you ain't scared of this dimension. I'm surprised that you're still able to make fun of me inside this dimension. True. Very, very true. Oh, that's right. Have you met Yuki yet? I had, but we got separated on our way. I see. That's too bad. Are you trying to get inside the dragon path too? Well, I've been wandering for a while to find a way in, but I found nothing. Not even a single clue. Anyway, I'm going to wander again. I'll leave the dragon path to you, Kayoko. Bye. You're, you're just going to leave me like that? I can't believe that he just left me like that. Yeah, exactly. Well, I guess it's up to me. There's a note on the floor. Show us Chikidihara's memo. Uh, no one's going to be able to find the dragon stone tablet. I threw it off the waterfall. I did it for Yukiko. Well, good lord, Taiga. You've been searching for how long? And you found nothing? I read a note on the floor. And clearly... It's at the bottom of the waterfall. What a dummy! Alright, so let's see what's down here. I was hoping that I didn't trigger something and I couldn't go back. It's locked from the inside. Okay. Well, that didn't make much of a difference anyways. I feel like I need a fishing rod or something. I just don't think there's anything here that I can use. Um... Hello? Okay, cool. Evil forces. Got it. Alrighty then. Yeah. So let's go see if we can find a fishing rod. Maybe in one of the fishermen's areas. Also, Taiga. Where'd you go, buddy? Seriously. There's got to be a rod or something I can use. Because I'm not just jumping off the base of the waterfall. That would be very, very dumb. Okay, that door's locked. Mo, you know what? I can't. I can't go back that way because the boulder's blocking my path. So fun. That's a good thing. That's a wonderful thing. I hope I didn't miss something. Like, I feel like I'm getting close to the end. I know I said there's four chapters, but they might be including the prologue. Hello? Anything here? Anything beneficial here at all? Oh. Hang on, hang on, hang on. This waterfall, I think I can jump down there if I want to. Sure. Nice landing. Oh, so each one has a different thing. Sweet Lincoln's mullet. 
That is the best translation ever. This room is as cold as freezing hell. Hold on a second. This room might be a part of the ice cavern. It might be. Hopefully we jump down the right place. Because I don't know. There's three different areas I guess we could jump. There's a door here. Oh! Ooh! Actually, know what? Before I die. Let's go up and save since it's literally right here. Okay, cool. So maybe I jump down the right path. Maybe some of those kill you and some of them don't. I don't know. I'm not sure what's going on. But I think I need a fishing rod. I don't know why, I just feel like that's the best thing to have because they talked about fishing and fishermen's and things. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Whoo! It's locked from the inside. God dang it, I don't need. Ow! Yeah, I figured that was gonna happen. Okay. <sighs> okay, so this room doesn't really help much, but there's more. No, is there not? Okay. So let's go back up, and we're just gonna jump off of another waterfall, I guess. Again and again, until we see if there's anything beneficial for us. Because that's the only other thing I can think of doing, is repeatedly jumping off of a waterfall. Everybody knows that's a good idea. Everybody out there is like, hey, there's a waterfall, you should jump off of it. Okay, uh, let's save the middle for last. Sure. Awesome. She's such a brave person. Something's not right about this room. I'll have to be careful. Okay. Excavation site. But what's not right about this? Oh, ho, ho. I see what's not right about this room. There's zombies. Oh, God, they're quick. But I'm quicker. Where am I going? Where do I need to be? Whoa, 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 whoa. I think, I think I'm kind of in a bad situation right now. Whew. Awesome. What's in here? There's a journal with lots of notes on the bookshelf, but among them there's a book that caught your attention. Digger's Journal. Okay. We are the diggers. Our quest is to dig the underground beneath the Kirihara Mansion. Our goal is to make, create an underground kingdom of Kirihara. Seijiro told us to keep digging further and further. Sometimes we wonder why he is interested in what is beneath the mansion. Perhaps if we keep digging as ordered, we'll find the answer. Many of us died because of the earthquakes, falling down into the abyss and got drowned in the river. <laughs> but that won't stop us from keeping, kept doing our job. You guys are dedicated. There's not very many people that do that, ever. Like, I'm pretty sure if a bunch of my coworkers died doing something, I'd be like, well, no, I think I'm good. Thanks, though. Ah! God dang it, I didn't even see him. There's got to be something down there. I know there has to be something down there. But what? That is the question. Okay, so there's got to be something there, but I guess since I'm already up here, we'll try the third of the middle section of the waterfall first, and then we'll go from there. Jump, don't die. Oh, you're dead. Yep, you're dead. Okay. Middle is bad, middle is death. Which means that those mines are hiding something. I just gotta find it. <sighs> it's always fun to run around when there's freaking zombies everywhere. Where did Taiga go, anyways? Seriously, he's like, I'll leave the rest to you. Bye. Jerk. Here we go. Hello. Shirokage. Oh, it's you again. What are you doing here? I don't think that this cave has anything to be investigated. Really? Because I've just discovered this cave a little while ago. Oh no, you don't jump off waterfalls like I do? Three years and you haven't found this place yet? Where have you been in those three years? Let me tell you something. When there's no living person inside this dimension, it will freeze us. So basically, in those three years, I was frozen, along with all the trapped souls. How many notes have you written then? So, are you saying that our arrival made the dimension become unfrozen? That's right. Well, for being able to make it this far, you're one hell of a girl, I must say. Really? I'll take that as a compliment. By the way, I want you to have this. 
Stone tablet. Oh. This is, is it the dragon tablet? Yes! It's the dragon stone tablet. I found it at the bottom of the waterfall. I bet no living human could have gotten the tablet without me. Okay, Mr. Braggy Pants. Thanks. All right, then. We'll make sure that you and the rest of the souls were trapped will be released soon. Heh. <laughs> I wish we could both meet, meet each other under different circumstances. But I'm a dead person now. I'll pray for your safety, then. Bye for now. Do I have to go back out there now? What, what is this feeling? When he handed the stone tablet, my heart skipped a beat. You're in love with the dead guy. Nope, nope, nope. He's a dead person. Exactly. I shouldn't think about that. Is there anything else here? <laughs> I'm just in like a pile of dirt. Okay, so I gotta make it back now. Well, crap. Uh-oh, I see you. I see you there, friend. It's so dark. Okay, I don't think there's anything else in that room. Oh, there is, isn't there? I gotta find a way out. Oh, man. Okay, okay. Okay, 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 guys. Guys, 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 slow down. Slow down just a little bit. Slow your roll, please. I see a door, and I want to go to it. Why are you freaking out? You, over there. Stop it. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. They're, like, all coming around. They're gonna... Uh-oh. Whew. I have no idea how I'm still alive, but I won't be for long, because that's going to happen. Oh, man. All right. Now I got to get the freaking tablet again, too. Oh, that cave. It just annoys me so much. Up here? Oh, thank God. I finally made it out of there. Oh, man. I can't even tell you guys how many times I died. Like that sucked. But we got the stone tablet. I'm going to save because I am not going through all that again. I hate those zombies. One little touch and you're dead. Forever. Because you can die temporarily too. I don't know what I'm talking about. I just went through a ton of pain and anguish because of freaking zombies. All right. So let me see if I can use the tablet now. Right? No? Was it not here? Oh, no, this is the other freezing room. I need to go upstairs. See, I'm so spun around. I don't even know what I'm doing. We're going to go over here. And we're going to go up. And this is where we use the tablet. The dragon path is now unsealed. Better be, after all that work. So this is the dragon path. It seems that you've unlocked the seal. Well, hi, Taiga. Good for you to join us. Huh? Taiga? Well, we can take both the ice sword and the holy stake now. By the way, how did you unlock the seal to this room? I got my face eaten off by zombies about 20 times in a row, if you must ask. Oh, about that. And the cultist gave me the key. Have you met him yet? Nope. I haven't met him. I met this hot other... Random ghosty girl, though. And we're supposed to be her fiancé, but I'm reincarnated, so she probably doesn't like me anymore. Anyway, let's get our stuff and put an end to all this. You're right. Let's go. Taiga joined you. Finally. I don't know what he's been doing. Sitting there at the vending machine or something. What's this? Oh, I can save. Okay, let's save. Awesome. Okay, so I guess we got to go to each room and maybe get the items? Is that what you want me to do? There's a hole here. I can sense it. Sense what? The Kori Tsurugi. Kori Tsurugi! A sword once owned by Seijiro Kirihara. It can be used to freeze evil spirits and exercising them. I can sense its presence deep inside this hole. Wow. That sounds awesome. But how do we take it out from this hole? Well, based on what I've read, the sword will come out by itself if someone who is worthy of using it appears. Just stabs him in the chest. What What was that just now? What, whoa! Kayoko, are you alright? Taiga! The door is sealed tight. Uh-oh. Taiga! He's trapped! I have to save him! T 
Taiga, are you alright? I think so. What happened? Hey, that's... That's the sword. Yeah, I think so. I guess this is the Kori Tsurugi. But, wow. I never thought you'd be the, you'll be the one chosen to wield it. I guess that's because I'm the reincarnation of the previous user. What, what do you mean? Oh, you know, just casual, casual talk. No big deal. Taiga told Kayako everything, uh, about everything that he has discovered. Then, we're all brought here because of that? Apparently, yes. We are all the reincarnation of the people in the past. Wait a second. If you're the reincarnation of this Haruto guy, then who, re who reincarnated as me? I don't know. You just can't find out about it that easy. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. What are you going to do next? I'm going to look for Yuki. <laughs> I guess our objectives are the same. But I think it's better to split up looking for her. Really? It has been settled then. But I guess I'm going to take the other sacred tools first. You can go on ahead. Okay then. See you around. I think you're so fancy because you got your sword. What a jerk. What's this? Hello? Okay. Bye then. Well, I think that's a good place to stop it. I got the mirror here that I can save. And then I just need to take a break from all those freaking zombies killing me. We'll go to the other door, see what's going on, see if we can meet up with Yuki. I'll try not to hit my microphone. And I guess that's going to be the end of this episode. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you enjoyed. I'll see you guys on the next MAMJ. Let's play. How do we encart? <laughs> I'm still hitting the camera flash button. I wonder who's behind this door. No, thank you. There's a key on the table. Whoa! Let me go. Oh, God. Oh, there's a key on the table. <laughs>